what she did to Reiko? It just dissolved. Yeah, I thought they were the bandits. Where's the other bandit gone? There he is. Two arrows, nice. Sounds like I leveled up. Yep. Awesome. I'll go with stamina. He wasn't really wearing the best armor, so makes sense that I Got him easy. Was it only two? pay for that doesn't look like it'll be me why is she carrying a human heart
Why can't I take their food? I can take that one and that one. But I can't take what's on that plate. How do I open this one? Oh, I've got no torches left. No torches. I was hoping to be able to look around up here to see if there was a lay lever or something to open it. Pull chain or something like that. Could it be that? Nice. Is that where I'm wanting to go? If that's the way I want to go then this is the way I'm gonna go. What damage does my bow do? 33. Yeah, I don't think I'll take that 14 bow. Gotcha. They triggered a fire trap down here somehow. 
Ah, they broke a rope that shot, made fire shoot out. That's the way I came, so this is a way I can't go. Okay, they go they go very similar to the same spot. So dark, hard for me to see too. Human flesh, what are they doing with human parts? Why are they carrying human parts around with them? Now I have a torch. And this is the rock dome. So I think this is the way I need to go back to the people. Will I pay for that now?
Did he fall off the edge? There he is. So I want to get back over here. There over in this area here, I believe. That map, it almost looks like from this entrance over here. There's a bridge over there. there ah that's the start of a bridge but it's not complete I thought it was out there I'm looking out there well I guess I need to Go in further. That's just bullshit. I told her not to fall for it. Gotcha. I can't see needing a human heart again. Whoa. <laughs> there we go. That trick has yet to disappoint me. So what do you say now, you piece of shit? I'll make you pay for what you... <laughs> That's just great. The fucker brought his bitch with him. Put down your weapon. I don't want to hurt you. Oh, is that so? All of your men are dead, and even if you manage to get past us, there are dozens of guards further up. So put down your weapon, or you will regret it. Such determination. All right, then. Die! As what? you wish. Uh...
Oh. Oh. Uh, are you are you all right? What the heck was that? I it, it's nothing. Did he hurt you? Can you walk? You didn't answer my question. What in blazes did just happen? Your eyes, the wit, the mist. You, you were different. What is this, an interrogation? As I see it, I just saved your damn life. So why don't you do me a favor and keep the questions to yourself? <sighs> I, I'm sorry, this is, it's too much right now. We'll talk about it once we get back to the temple. Now, come on, we should push forward. I fell, thank Malthus, into a thicket farther down the ruin. It was some kind of machine room, at least that's what it looked like to me. And luckily enough, that's also how the traps in the entrance are being controlled. I tried to deactivate them. We'll see if it worked. Anyway, do you see the camp down there? We should take a look at it. Down here. That's worth quite a bit. One-handed attacks do 5% more damage. Heavy armor fortified by 5 points. That sounds pretty good. I think was... That's the one I... Was this the way I came from? Yep. So that's what this was all about. They flit here to protect their loot. We should bring this to the order. Maybe we can find out who they stole it from. No, you can't do that, please. Stay right there. Who are you? I'm not one of them. Please don't hurt me. I... Oh, by the righteous path. What did I get myself into? You're not one of the bandits. Then who are you? Alice. Alice Summerstone. I'm just a simple man, a farmer by me path. I have two daughters, me woman and a little farm girl just a few miles from Ark. Maybe you know one of me girls. She sells our bread at the market, Mondas de Freiras. The skinny one with blonde hair? Yes, exactly. That's her. My little Serta. Explain yourself. Why are you here? Right, of course. Do you know who Landlord Borek is? He's one of the most influential landlords of the Farmer's Coast. Both the Guard and the Order get their food from his lands. What does he have to do with this? Everything. He's a pathless bastard. And all of this, all of this is his fault. I swear it by me name. Why? Because he's a criminal, that's why. <sighs> believe me, I know how that sounds. But it's the truth. You have to believe me. The tolls he collects from his tenants are so high that we hardly have anything left to eat. And those who don't pay get beaten up by his lackeys. But that's not all of it. He also knows the Relata. Hey Ben, how you doing today? Or tonight? The Relata? The cult from un the Undercity? Aye, who else? They believe themselves above Malthus. Above the Holy Path. They are powerful. Which is also why no one does anything about them. And let me guess, this gold belongs to Borek, and you hope that his supposed cruelty justifies your theft? No. No, this money isn't his. I had debts. It all started three years ago, when we had a very bad harvest, and I couldn't pay me toll for the first time. Borek gave me a loan, but he said that I'd have to pay interest next time. Well, I think you can figure out the rest. 
Yeah, I'm not doing too bad. Thank you. You got into more and more debt, and you were looking for a way to pay everything at once. Aye. I knew from a friend that there was this man in the Undercity, this Carrick. And he said that he and his men might be willing to help me, if they would get money from it. Apparently, they even had a sense of honor and path abidingness, if you can call it that. So you made a bargain with them, but whose pennies are those? They... they're from a traveling merchant. We ambushed them, and you know what we did. But I swear by me name we didn't hurt him. When we had the money, all Sunfire started breaking loose. Some kind of woman appeared, all veiled and dressed in black. And in the wink of an eye, she killed two of Carrick's men. We tried to fight her at first, but then we ran for it. Well, and ended up in this ruin. GOG, yep. I use the GOG 2.0 launcher for playing all my games. I like how it keeps all your games in one place from all the different launches. A veiled woman with dark robes and a low voice. She didn't speak much, but yes, she had dark robes and she was different, unholy. Sorry, I'm, I don't know how to describe her any better. Is Oblivion, is that the third or fourth? I think that's the Elder Scrolls 4, isn't it? The one I'm, I don't have yet. <laughs> you realise that Carrick's men killed three guards from Ark. So much for bandits with honour. I know. I was there. Carrick was so mad about all that happened with this witch woman, you know? I think he just wanted to get his men to safety, but still, you're right. I was a fool to trust him, and I regret what I did. Yeah, I, I know I've got Elder Scrolls 3 and 5. 5 being Skyrim. I think 3 is Morrowind. I believe 4 is Oblivion. If 4 is Oblivion, it's the one I don't have. And now you expect me to turn you loose with the money, right? To save your farm? Me farm and me family. Aye. Please, it's the right thing to do. If I don't have the money by the next turn of the moon, Borak and his lackeys will change their tune. And I know what that means. Yeah, I see the message. Thanks for that. I'll activate it after the stream. Very much appreciate it. What do you think, Kalaya? Hmm. It's a tough call. I can understand his motivation, but that doesn't change the consequence of his actions. If we let him run, we legitimize his crime, so to speak. You should justify your crime before the tribunal. Explain to them what Boric did, and they might judge you lightly. <laughs> judge lightly? You don't really believe that, do you? They don't care about the why, and even if they do, it doesn't change a damn thing about the fact that my family is lost without this money. Maybe, but it doesn't change that you're at least partially responsible for what happened here. But it's your call. 